my name is Jillian and this is Jilly Camps Arizona and today we're going to be reviewing the Platypus 2 liter water bottle. This is one of my absolute favorite water bottles to use. I use these when I go camping in the Grand Canyon, when I go hiking with my brother, when we go hiking in the Grand Canyon. These collapsible water bottles are an instant lifesaver. They hold two liters in this foldable plastic water bottle. I've also seen people use them when they go on, um, when you go on a cruise and people say that you could put something clear like vodka in it and take it on your luggage because people think that it's just a water bottle. So, you know, not that I'm condoning the illegal use of these water bottles, but I'm just saying that is also a usage that people have found with this bottle. So I use it, however, primarily to go hiking in the appropriate manner because I am like a camel that my uh, friend Prashant frequently calls me a camel because I have to take minimum five liters of water if we're doing 10 miles. I drink a crap load of water and in a short amount of time. So I need lots of water on the trail. And for me, these are perfect because after you're done pouring this into a larger three liter bottle, then you could just crinkle it up and stuff it in your pack. And it doesn't take that much room at all. As you can see, it just crinkles into this tiny, tiny folded piece. So some of the features of this, obviously it's flexible, high capacity bottle for easy packing modular accessories let you create your own system and i do highly recommend buying in conjunction with this the uh, push pull cap to make it a lot easier to pour the water into a three liter bottle and to aim more appropriately the push pull cap also comes with a clear cap to keep it in place more tightly and let me tell you it works great and that is the exact thing that i use when i go camping hiking etc in the grand canyon or just hiking with my brother in general i'm not going to open this one because i ended up i usually buy these when they're on sale on amazon for about ten dollars a piece i buy like two or three of them at a time in order to restock my supply list so this is the second one and I just threw away a, a one because the only downside to these is that they do get moldy on the inside after a time. And that's simply because after washes, you can't get inside this little tiny area right here. You know, it's too small and you can't fit like a cloth to clean it. So you just rinse it out after every use, dump it and then dry it kind of evenly on the bag. But you know, it, it doesn't dry perfectly sometimes, especially if it's more humid in your area. So anyway, so this is what it looks like. I'm not going to do an official unboxing, but I wanted to show you what a brand new one. I just opened this. So this is what one looks like. And I do have the push pull cap. I usually lose the plastic dust cover on it almost instantly. But as you can see, it's very clean, even though I've used it and it's got helpfully helpful handy features on the side for one liter and two liter listed here on the side so you know when you're at the two liter mark and i don't recommend going above this i usually go just a tiny bit above it and that's because when you're pressing it to get the air out you need this space up here so that it doesn't overflow when you open it for the first time so this is a great feature and i love these absolutely love these even if you can't get inside to clean them as you can see, the opening on this is pretty small and the bag is huge. So you simply cannot get in there unless you have some type of special cleaning tool uh, to clean it appropriately. So I just like to rinse it out really good right after I'm done, let it dry to make sure it's fully dry before the next usage. So, um, but I love these and I simply can't say enough about them. Again, not a sponsor. I'm simply doing this because I love hiking and I love helping people find the right equipment. So anyway, so that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching this Jillian Camps Arizona video. Feel free to thumbs up this content if you enjoyed it and you want to see more like it. Also, if you're not currently following me and you want to follow me around, feel free to hit that subscribe button below or you can like my page on Facebook. That's at Jillian Camps Arizona. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.